Plastic, and let me show you how to bypass Google verification on the following device. So basically, let me show you how to remove FRP, how to unlock the factory reset protection. So this tutorial will solve solve your forgot Google account problem. So at the very beginning, let's just use the back key to go back to the first screen. And here you need to find and select the welcome panel. Choose here vision settings. Here you need to tap talk back right here. Let's enable TalkBack, let's use the service tab, okay, to confirm it. TalkBack is a screen reader primarily for people with blindness and low vision. It allows interaction with the device using spoken feedback. TalkBack tutorial. Let's write L on the screen, simply L. Alert global context menu. Read from top and list seven items. Double tap to activate. From the following list, let's choose dim screen. Double tap to confirm it. All right, now let's hold down together volume down and volume up simultaneously. Let me show you. Keep holding both keys. Tap, use shortcut, double tap to confirm it. Let's use volume down and volume up one more time. Talkback is disabled, so that's what we need. So here you can use the following search icon and let's search here YouTube. All right, let's tap YouTube, choose here the notifications, select additional settings in the app. From the following options, let's choose here the about option right here, the last one. Tap Google privacy policy, tap accept and continue, choose no thanks. And as you can see, now we can use the Chrome. So let's here type in hard reset info. Alright, so here let's use this menu, tap download, here let's enter the Android 8 phrase. Alright, tap search, so let's use this app, Google account protection bypass so let me scroll down and choose here download tap continue tap allow chrome to access photos media and files on your device tap ok to the following warning choose open tap settings right here let's allow from this source let's go back so now you can use install the FRP bypass is installing, tap open right here. That's it, this is the FRP bypass app. Let's choose here Google account manager for the version 6.0. So here let's tap settings. Let's allow from this source. Let's go back, tap install. All right, choose done, tap bypass FRP, browser sign in. Use this three dots, this more key, and tap browser sign in again. Tap OK to confirm it. So now it's time to enter the Google account. So you should here sign in into some Google account. It could be any Google account not connected to this device, even the new one, just the Google account that you know the email and the password. So let me enter here my email. Tap next. Let me enter the password. If you are ready, let's choose sign in. All right, FRP bypass app should pop up. So now let's just press power key, choose restart and wait a couple of seconds.
all right the welcome panel pops up so here let me go through this initializing step process let me agree to the following conditions let me choose no thanks to this programs let's skip mobile network connection let me not copy any data and as you can see account added so the account that you add previously in that process is added so it's a good sign so let's tap next let me tap more and accept skip the face unlock and the fingerprint protection let me skip everything just to activate the home screen tap next and as you can see just activate your home screen but to fully erase frp and everything connected with factory reset protection let's accomplish the hard reset by using the settings so let's find here and select settings right here then from the list of settings you need to choose system choose here reset options and select erase all data factor reset let me erase everything including the internal storage even so let me perform the full reset tab reset phone and choose erase everything wait until the operation will be completed do not interrupt while the process is running Alright, the welcome panel pops up, so here let me quickly go through the initializing step process just to check out if I can activate my device without the Google account. So let me choose no thanks here a couple of times, let me skip mobile network and Wi-Fi connection. It's a good sign that we can skip the Wi-Fi connection. Here let me leave everything with the default configuration, let me also skip the face unlock and fingerprint. So let's tap next a couple of times. As you can see, just activate your device. So everything went well. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe our channel, leave thumbs up under the video.